Margot Robbie. About Margot Robbie. Margot Elise Robbie is an Australian actress and producer. Her work includes both blockbuster and independent films, and her accolades include nominations for three Academy Awards, six BAFTA Awards, and four Golden Globe Awards. Wikipedia. Born, July 2, 1990, age 33 years, Dalby, Australia. Spouse, Tom Ackerley, M. 2016. Height, 1.68 meters Upcoming movie, A Big, Bold, Beautiful Journey. Parents, Sari Kessler, Doug Robbie. Siblings, Anya Robbie, Cameron Robbie, Lachlan Robbie. Margot Robbie Australian actor Margot Robbie, who starred in the 2023 Barbie movie, is best known for her roles in The Wolf of Wall Street, Suicide Squad, and I, Tanya. Latest news, Barbie star and producer Margot Robbie competes for Best Picture at the 2024 Oscars. Actor Margot Robbie made a splash as the star of Barbie, particularly during the press tour ahead of the movie's July 2023 release when she wore iconic Barbie outfit after iconic Barbie outfit. But Robbie, 33, did more than bring the famous doll to life. She also had a major hand in bringing last year's biggest blockbuster to life as one of the movie's producers. Now, she and her co-producers have the chance to bring home Oscar trophies for Best Picture at the 2024 Academy Awards. Since this year's Oscar nominations were announced in January, Robbie's absence from the Best Actress race has been cited as one of the biggest snubs, alongside Barbie director Greta Gerwig's in the directing category. For her part, Robbie isn't sweating it. There's no way to feel sad when you know you're this blessed, she said at a recent SAG AFTRA screening of the movie. Obviously I think Greta should be nominated as a director, because what she did is a once-in-a-career, once-in-a-lifetime thing, what she pulled off, it really is. But it's been an incredible year for all the films. A win on March 10th would mark Robbie's first Oscar, though she has been nominated twice before for her leading and supporting roles in I, Tanya and Bombshell, respectively. Who is Margot Robbie? Margot Robbie is an Academy Award, nominated actor known for her roles as Harley Quinn in Suicide Squad and controversial figure skater Tanya Harding in the biopic I, Tanya. Following in the footsteps of her Australian countrywomen Nicole Kidman and Kate Blanchett, Robbie first took the film world by storm in Martin Scorsese's 2013 movie The Wolf of Wall Street. More recently, she portrayed actor Sharon Tate in Quentin Tarantino's Once Upon a Time in Hollywood and earned a supporting Oscar nod for her role in Bombshell. In July 2023, Robbie headlined and produced the Greta Gerwig, directed Barbie movie, which became the year's highest-grossing blockbuster and earned a Best Picture Oscar nomination. Full name, Margot Elise Robbie. Born, July 2, 1990. Birthplace, Dalby, Queensland, Australia. Spouse, Tom Ackerley, 2016-present. Astrological sign, Cancer. Childhood and early career on Neighbours. Margot Elise Robbie was born in Dalby, Queensland, Australia on July 2, 1990, and grew up in Gold Coast, a city 500 miles north of Sydney. Her mother, Sari Kessler, is a physiotherapist who raised her and her three siblings after her parents divorced. Her father is Doug Robbie. Robbie told Vanity Fair that she thought she might be a magician, but an interest in drama in high school led her to Melbourne and a kid's show, The Elephant Princess, co-starring the up-and-coming Liam Hemsworth. She has been professionally acting since her teens. Before she left for Hollywood, Australian audiences knew her from the TV soap opera Neighbours, which began airing five years before her birth. Fearing she failed her audition, she decided to vacation in Canada but had to return quickly when she found out she had won the part of the vivacious Donna Friedman in 2008. Donna's kiss with a female friend stirred controversy, though she remained a viewer favorite and was nominated for several awards. She left Neighbours in 2010, in a boring old happy ending. Hollywood Breakthrough, Wolf of Wall Street and Focus Leonardo DiCaprio and Margot Robbie attend a 2014 premiere of The Wolf of Wall Street. 
Robbie's role as the wife of DiCaprio's Jordan Belfort helped launch her mainstream career. If you remember Robbie's debut film, The Australian Made ICU, a serial killer thriller shot when she was 17 and released in 2009. Her part in Richard Curtis' time travel rom-com About Time, 2013, with Donnell Gleeson and Rachel McAdams, made more of a splash. But it was her role as Naomi, Leonardo DiCaprio's Brooklyn bombshell wife and the Duchess of Bay Ridge, in Martin Scorsese's Based on a True Story epic of financial flim-flammery The Wolf of Wall Street, 2013, that turned heads. Robbie also got attention for her small but standout role playing herself in The Big Short in 2015. The comedic scene involved her explaining mortgage-backed securities and subprime loans, all the while floating in a tub of bubbles with champagne in hand. That year also saw her first lead roles. Robbie co-starred opposite Will Smith in Focus, playing con artists who steal each other's hearts. She also starred in the sci-fi drama Z for Zachariah. Harley Quinn in Suicide Squad. One of Robbie's most notable roles is as the punkily attired fan fave Harley Quinn. She first appeared in the role in the comics-based Smash Suicide Squad, 2016. Harley Quinn is the psychopsychiatrist who is amused to Jared Leto's Joker. Robbie told the Washington Post that diving into a vat of gluggy paint stuff to bleach Harley's skin in one scene was the most unpleasant thing I've ever done in my entire life and her spiky accoutrement wasn't exactly comfortable either. Robbie planned to reprise her popular characterization of Harley Quinn in Gotham City Sirens, though that project was shelved in favor of another spin-off Birds of Prey, which co-starred Ewan McGregor and hit theaters in February 2020. Robbie again portrayed Harley Quinn in 2021's The Suicide Squad. Recent Movies, Amsterdam, Babylon, and Asteroid City in recent years, Robbie's star power has continued to shine. After reprising her role as Harley Quinn in Birds of Prey, 2020, and The Suicide Squad, 2021, the actor moved on to 2022's Amsterdam. In the period piece set during World War I, Robbie plays Valerie Vose, a nurse who helps two injured soldiers played by Christian Bale and John David Washington. The film loosely follows a conspiracy plot to remove President Franklin D. Roosevelt from office and replace him with a dictator. That same year saw the release of Babylon, in which Robbie's Nellie Leroy and other characters try to live out their dreams of achieving Hollywood fame and stardom in the 1920s. In the rapidly evolving film industry, Nellie struggles to adapt and succumbs to vices that include drug use and gambling, which jeopardize her at girl status and career. The role earned Robbie her third Golden Globe nomination and second for Best Actress. Robbie was also among the star-studded cast in Wes Anderson's 2023 Asteroid City, which offers a meta-story within a story plot that takes place in a 1950s desert town. Other cast members included Jason Schwartzman, Scarlett Johansson, Tom Hanks, Tilda Swinton, Edward Norton, Adrian Brody, and Maya Hawke. Barbie in 2019, Warner Brothers and Mattel announced Robbie would take on the role of Barbie in Greta Gerwig's highly anticipated Barbie live-action movie. Robbie's Lucky Chap Entertainment co-produced the project. Margot Robbie attends the Barbie premiere in a black evening gown inspired by the 1960s solo in the spotlight Barbie doll. During the press tour leading up to the film's July 2023 release, Robbie wore some of Barbie's most iconic looks throughout the years, including 1990s Enchanted Evening Doll, 1960s Solo in the Spotlight Doll, the 1992 Totally Hair Doll, and a dress inspired by the 1959 black and white swimsuit Barbie. The internet collectively obsessed over the opening shot in a Barbie trailer that showed a pair of feet, soon revealed to be Robbie's, sliding out of heeled sandals and not losing the tiptoe arched stance of an actual Barbie doll's feet. Robbie, who is five foot six, has previously mentioned that having big feet can be embarrassing when she can't find heels in her size, but recently said she's really flattered that people are excited about my feet. In the movie, Robbie's Barbie has an existential crisis that takes her away from Barbie land and brings her to the real world. Ryan Gosling co-starred as Ken, while other Hollywood heavyweights, like Simu Liu, play different iterations of the Ken doll. Issa Rae, Will Ferrell, Kate McKinnon, America Ferreira, Emma Mackey, Dua Lipa, and Michael Sarah also appear in the film. 
It debuted the same day as the equally anticipated biopic Oppenheimer, leading moviegoers to dub the joint release Barbenheimer. Barbie became the highest-grossing film of 2023 and set numerous records, including the highest-earning movie directed by a woman. That success translated into a slew of award nominations and the 2024 Golden Globe for Cinematic and Box Office Achievement, which Robbie and Gerwig accepted on behalf of the team. Individually, Robbie received a Golden Globe nomination for Best Actress. Husband Margot Robbie and husband Tom Ackerley in June 2023. Robbie met assistant director Tom Ackerley on the World War II drama Sweet Frances, 2014. The two began dating and eventually got married in December 2016. They don't have any children. Net worth Robbie's net worth shot up significantly in 2023 thanks to the actor's starring role in Barbie. According to Variety, Robbie's salary for the role was $12.5 million, boosting her total net worth to an estimated $40 million.